Welcome to the view by DJ's PRC. We have the Armor Outcast, and it's going to be his first run after the upgrade I just did on it. And those upgrades are the Hot Racing, Caster Block, C Hubs, and Rear Carriers on it. And if we take the body off, you will see them. The C hubs and the casters in front and the rear carriers. I'm not sure if you can see them right now. But they're there. Uh, the bottom part is aluminum and the top part is carbon fiber. Same thing for the front. And sorry for the noise. The street beside me is very noisy today. But Yep, let's uh, pop the hood back on and let's take them on these ramp right here around here and see how she goes. And now we do have the Outcast with the upgrades and we do have the Creighton 4S. Uh, that's the other edition we have in the, in the, on the channel. That is the newest 4S, a little bit wider, a little bit longer than the Outcast itself. Uh, that one is 100% stock. And yeah, let's have fun. Let's see what we're going to break today. I hope not. But if we do, it is what it is. It's part of the machine. <laughs> Just broke the dry shaft on it. And I hope it's not one of the new ones. Yeah, it is. And you see it right here. Even lost the other part. Enjoy the Creighton Forest. The other chassis of the Creighton. Thank <laughs> you. 
and like you can see these machines takes a beating and keeps on ticking now same for the outcast okay it doesn't really show the strength of it but i think there's a maybe a defective uh trash shaft so that is a brand new one that i've installed on it and the reason is the last time i went out and played with it i am extremely rough on the machine to the point that i literally don't care about it i bought it to have fun it is a fun machine for our 4s machine it's awesome it's a machine i recommend to anybody but yeah i did break the two drive shafts on it one in front one in the rear and today was the first time playing with it again since i did the drive shafts and i broke i broke it broke again i do have a spare one at home out <laughs> the wish well wasn't the way yeah once i'm back home in the studio i'll swipe the dry shaft around and come back And the running time too, it's uh, they are impressive. The running time they have. And it's running on a 5000 4S. And if I remember correctly, I think that's uh, in that one, it's a 50cc discharge. Now, if you guys have any questions or comment, post them below. Down, post them below, should I say? And I'll be gladly to answer you guys. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to hit that like button, and don't forget to subscribe. It helps the channel a lot, and I do appreciate it very much. Thank you.